Hey people, so I thought I would give it a go to make something with projectors and the thing I came up with was a kinetic weapon system. Um, basically, uh, you weld your kinetic projectile. I added a few... Um, two warheads or three or something at the end for penetrating power. Uh, you weld it, you rotate it to finish the weld on the other side, then you release it with this um, grinder and you stop the ship. You of course have to be at speed, uh, well you have to accelerate first, then aim yourself at the target, then release and then stop your ship so you won't fly into it. Now, uh, I've had to fiddle a bit with the whole projector thing because I thought, uh, first off, I thought I could just build an empty space, then I found out it was attached, then I tried adding grinders, then I found out that I actually have to, it has to be a separate grid for you to grind it. So basically I've attached a small rotor head to a large rotor, which also allows me to build a small grid projectile. And yeah, um, I might as well just demonstrate instead of talk about it. Anyhow, we start by welding all the way, because everything has to be connected all the way up. And once we reach the top, we just rotate at the time. And there we go, we are ready to deploy. Now I've placed the target at the antenna at the platform. Uh, it's a big metal plate, four blocks thick I believe. Now we just gotta get up to speed while aiming, and there we go. And we grind, and that's it. Projectile away, and we are ready to uh, fabricate another projectile. This really makes uh, kinetic projectiles, kinetic weapons in general, uh, feasible in my opinion. Because before you had to go back to base and stuff like that, it was just hell. Anyhow, um, so yeah, as you can see, uh, kinetic projectiles are quite effective, at least against soft targets. I've not tested it against heavy armor, I may do that later, but uh, yeah, who cares. So yeah, that is uh, it. I will be adding the workshop link for this if anyone wants to take a look at it. Um, and if anyone has any questions regarding this video or space engineers in general, feel free to ask in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer and help. Thank you for watching and see ya.